bevel on this 14 gauge cannula is about seven millimeters, which means that when you're advancing this cannula after flashback, you might need to advance it even up to 10 to 15 millimeters to make sure that the bevel and the cannula is inside the lumen of the vein before you feed it off. That's really important to know. And I'm gonna be demonstrating that now. The first thing I do is give a little local anesthetic injection at the appropriate site. And then we're getting ready to insert the cannula itself. I tense the skin and make sure my thumb is out of the way so I can get a nice low angle of insertion. And then I just go through the skin. Now I'm inserting really slowly and I see flashback immediately. I then level off and I try to lift up the vein and then I advance that minimal amount, 10 to 15 millimeters. I then feed off and as you can see, I get the secondary flashback. I then take my bung and I put it onto the end and then I first jiggle it to make sure it's on and then I grip the cannula and put it on more firmly. One quick thing to make sure that it's in. Take my normal saline flush, just flush and that's done.